Bye, Daddy. You and all your friends looked really young back then. We sure were. It'll be nice to see a lot of them tonight. Some of these people I haven't seen in 30 years. That's a long time. Yeah, even I can't believe it's been that long. Oh, that's probably Jessica. I'll get it. Wow. So, are we ready to head out? Yes. Rosalie just went to let Jessica in. Good. I see you dug out the old yearbook. Yeah, I was showing our daughter what high school life was like, back in the olden days. Hello. Hey there Jessica. Hi Jessica, how are you? I'm doing good. Oh yes, Nate also told me to say hi to Rosalie's parents for him. So, hello from Nate. Well, tell that adorable brother of yours that we said hello too. I will. Well, shall we? Yes. All right, Jessica, the place is yours. And thank you again for babysitting tonight. Of course. You guys have fun at the reunion. I hope you have fun seeing all your old friends, Daddy. Thanks, sweetie. I will. You and Jessica have a nice time, too. And be good. I will. Bye, sweetheart. We'll see you later. I love you. Love you both. I'll call Abins and order the pizza. And I'll sign into Netflix and queue up Beta Squad. Do you Stray from a party. Well, quite a turnout. So, should we go and mingle? I don't see why not. Howard Collins, Mr. KTY, over here. Hiram Lee, good to see you. You too. Missed you at the 10th and 20th reunions. I'm glad you decided to show up to this one. Well, I figured it'd be nice to come to at least one of these things. Yeah, I hear you. Well, I don't believe I've met your better half yet. I'm Hiram. I'm Allison. It's good to meet you. Good to meet you too. So, have you all seen Sandra yet? She's been wondering when you were gonna show. No, not yet. Well, last I saw her was near the bar area. Go on and say hi, she's looking forward to seeing you. Will do. Good seeing you again Hiram. Drew Armstrong. I figured I'd spot you at the bar. Well well, Howard the ultimate morning DJ. You made it. Hello Allison, you're looking great as always. Hello Drew. So, have you seen Sandra around? Just missed her. Her and the wife left a few minutes ago to mingle, but she was definitely asking for you. I can call her back here if you like. Nah, it's all good Drew. We'll run into her eventually. Oh no it's fine Howie boy, I know exactly how to get Sandra's attention. Watch this. He's really gonna do it isn't he? He wouldn't be Drew Armstrong if he didn't. Hey Armstrong, just like senior prom huh? Hell yeah, who's ready to get down? Drew Armstrong. Yes, Sandra. Stop it, tootin' on my table. See, there she is. Much appreciated, Drew. Howard, Allison, there you are. How are you, Sandra? Just wonderful. Thank you for coming. Of course. Everything looks great. Well, thank you. I would hope so. Allison, always so good to see you. You too, Sandra. And I have to agree with my husband. You really did a great job with everything. I especially love the favors. Glad you like them. My son helped me put them together. So how is Aaron doing? Well, 
Did I tell you that he just got engaged recently? No, I don't believe you have. That's great, Sandra. Congratulations. Yes, congratulations. That's wonderful. Thank you. And don't forget, you're both invited to the wedding. We look forward to it. Raymond, mind of Sylvia and I borrow Lauren for a bit? We want to introduce her around to the ladies. Not at all. Us guys are probably gonna go hang with Howard. Have fun. You know, I've seen just about everyone I expected to be here, but I haven't seen Sugar. I thought for sure she'd be here by now. Oh, you know her, Albert. Sugar's all about that fashionably late entrance. That way, all eyes can be on her when she walks in. Isn't that the truth? Right, just like the last two reunions. You guys talking about Sugar Ray Dawson? Yeah, that's right, Sturdbacken. Shit, man. I've been waiting for her to show up since I got here. I had the biggest crush on that girl ever since freshman year. And just between us guys? I think she's always had a little thing for me too. I mean, she had like, a million boyfriends throughout high school. But I could tell it was me that she always wanted. And who could blame her? I was the studliest guy in the whole class of 93. You know, I bet if she shows up here and sees me, she wouldn't be able to resist that Sturdbacken charm. Hey, uh, ain't that your wife standing there behind you? As I was saying, I have no interest in that washed up bitch Sugar Dawson. And quite frankly, I'm offended that you guys would even suggest that I talk to her, knowing full well that I'm happily married. Seriously, honey. Can you believe the nerve of these guys? Uh-huh. But let me tell you about this one person who called in. Get this. He said his name was Spank Me Daddy. Bruh, some dude calls into the show and he's like, yo, this is Spank Me Daddy? Oh man Sally and I just started busting up right there. The guy just wanted to win his concert tickets. But we could barely get a word out cause we were laughing so hard. You always seem to attract the crazy callers, don't you? I think you used to get them even back when you were at KFMY. Oh it's not just Howard. I've also gotten my fair share of weirdos. There was one time when this- Well well, look who's finally decided to show up. Who's that? Who do you think? Sugar Dawson. Like I said, fashionably late entrance. My god Drew, look at her. She hasn't aged a day in 30 years. Have you ever seen someone after so many years and thought, that's the one that got away? Dude, remember Jenna, your wife? Sugar who? You see that? She just waved. Now she's coming over. Sandra, there's my girl. Are we invisible? Girl, I've been waiting for you to show. Well, here I am. Now the party can officially start, right? That's right. You look great, by the way. Love the dress. Oh, thank you, honey. You look beautiful as well. Why, thank you. So, where's Michael? Let me guess, he went straight to the bar. Oh that's probably where he'd be if he were here. But he actually had other commitments tonight. Like what sort of commitments? Well, he's got a reunion of his own. He and his old biker bros from college, are getting together for their annual camping weekend. Drew Armstrong. How the hell are you you crazy bastard? Oh you know, the usual. I must say Chen, it's actually good to see you again. You too. Amazing what a difference 30 years makes, right? Yes indeed buddy. Albert, good to see you as well. You too Drew, even though the last time we saw each other was yesterday at the store. I know man, it's been a lifetime. 
So, have you fellas said hi to Sugar Dawson yet? No, they haven't just yet. Hello gentlemen. Pure cane sugar, how's it going? I'm doing great leg week. Yourself? Ha, ah, damn you haven't called me leg week since high school. Well I figured tonight would be a good time to revive that old favorite. And of course, I could not wait to see the three of you either. I saw Howard and Albert when I was here in town last year. But Raymond Chen. Wow. How long has it been? It's been too long. It's really nice to see you again Sugar. I just hope you don't throw your shoe at me again tonight. You're not gonna let me live that one down are you? I wouldn't blame him Sugar. You nearly took his eye out with that thing. Are you kidding? She nearly decapitated us all. You guys are so funny. I miss you all so much. So, Sugar. I'm sure you remember me. Archer the Magnificence. Elroy stirred Bakken. Yeah, I remember you now. Well, damn. I was hoping you didn't remember that ridiculous name. Oh, and Archer the Magnificence is so much better. Oh, shut it, Collins. The chicks loved that name back in high school. Pay no attention to these guys, Sugar. I think they're all jealous of the fact that no girl ever turned me down in high school. Oh, I did. All the time. Oh, yeah. I guess I forgot about that. Hey, Sturd Bakken, weren't you the one who said that Sugar was hot for you back then? Oh, did he now? Will you all get out of here? Hello, Sugar. Jenna Williams, come here. Hey, honey. Wait a minute. Are you and Elroy? Yes, we are. Ten years now. Well, this is a pleasant surprise. Congratulations. And allow me to correct myself. Jenna Sturd Bakken. Thank you. And I hope he's not bothering you too much. I know how those Sturd Bakken men are. Right, honey buns? Babe, I was just talking. Besides, you think I haven't seen you chatting it up with all your ex-boyfriends here. Only two. Stop exaggerating. Right. Only two. Anyway, I thought you'd like to know that we're all doing jello shots at the bar, in case you're interested. Jello shots? Hell yeah. Hey y'all, don't start without me. I knew he wouldn't turn that down. So how about you sugar, care to join us for a few? Maybe in a while hun. Right now, I wanna spend some time with my boys. Alright well, we'll be at the bar. Good to see you again. You too. Sugar, come on over. Well boys, I noticed something missing here. Where are your wives? Don't tell me you all left him at home. No they're here somewhere. They all just kind of went off into their own group. Well I should go find them. I'd love to say hello. You do that, I think I'm gonna head over to the bar. Those jello shots are calling my name. Oh boy, once stirred Bakken and Armstrong get a little alcohol in them, I imagine that's when the real fun will begin. Oh boy, looks like you and me were the ones who hung on the longest, Drew. How about we down another one? Nah, I'm good. How about you, Sandra? Oh, I'm tapping out too. Four is good enough for me. I think that's enough for you too, Elroy. I don't want to have to leave the car here and call an Uber. Oh, don't worry, Jenna. I feel great. Hey, Samir. You look like you could handle anything. About how many jello shots do you think you can do? I've been known to put away up to 20 shots. Without getting drunk. Not bad. I remember when I was a young buck like you, I could handle that many. But I'm definitely a little buzzed right now. You know what I feel like doing, honey? Popping up on one of those tables and doing the stirred bock and stop. Oh, Sandra will definitely have something to say about that. Oh, she definitely will. No tooting on the tables. That's Ms. Mathis's number one rule. Yeah, yeah, I know the drill. You break price, you pay rules. But I'll have you all know, I wasn't voted the class clown for no reason. Don't forget, 
We both were voted class clown. Yes, we were. Well, if you two are about to remind us why we voted you class clowns, then do it out on the dance floor, not the tables. If you say so. All right, Armstrong. Let's show all these turkeys what real fun is like. Man, you gotta teach me how to do that stirred balk and stomp. Girl, I hope old Archer the Magnificence won't embarrass you too badly. Oh, he does a better job embarrassing himself, especially with that ridiculous nickname. So did you have a nice time? I had a great time. It was nice seeing so many familiar faces, and some that I haven't seen since graduation. I can't believe in a few more years, it'll be my 30-year reunion. You plan on going? Are you kidding? I wouldn't miss it. Howard, come on over here. Well, it's the whole gang. Hey, I hope you weren't gonna slip out of here without taking a group picture with us. Of course not. Let's do it. You guys remember that picture we all took in the school hallway freshman year? We should totally recreate it. Now that's a good idea. It'll be a little different, since we're missing a few people. That's right, Steven Junt and Kendra aren't here, so Ray can substitute for them. Sure, I can be Steven. Too bad we don't have someone to fill in for the twins. Hey y'all, we're heading out. Good to see you again. Hey Armstrong, bring your ass on over here and get a group picture with us first. You want moi, in your group photo? I'm honored. I think this will make a good backdrop. So, are we ready? Yes, let's get into our pose fellas. Alright, are you all ready? Ready babe. Okay, smile. Good job class of 93. Well, another reunion come and gone. We should all hang out like this again. And more often too, instead of every 10 years. Well, life can get pretty hectic when you're running a New York modeling agency. But I can definitely make the time to fly out here again anytime. And I can always find time to take a break from being a hotshot San Francisco lawyer, and come see all my Tyndale friends. Well, everyone, until next time. Okay, fellas, just the way we practiced. Ready? Ready. All righty then. One, two, three, hit it. Amber, what's up? How've you been? I'm doing good, Jessica. What are you up to right now? I'm doing some babysitting tonight. Sounds fun. So is business booming now that summer's almost here? It's been steady. I get maybe two or three babysitting gigs a week. It's nice to have a little side job to earn some extra income. That's cool. Hey listen, I got some good news. What's that? Okay, so me and Belinda will be attending a five-day songwriting retreat up in Yosemite in a little over two weeks. And when it's done, we were thinking of coming to Tyndale to visit. Wow, that's so awesome Amber. I can't wait. <laughs> 